contestant do you choose? Uh, number two. Number two. So, you're about to go on your date with The Bachelorette Meg. How are you feeling? Well, I'm a little nervous, trying to mentally prepare myself. I don't know, we'll see how it goes. I see you went with the uh, beige sweater combo. How, what, what led this on? Yeah, polo, trying to look as fresh as I can. The beige really does complement your skin tone. Yeah, thanks. That's what I was thinking when I was putting it on. So, you're about to go on the date with Bachelor Michael. How do you feel? Um, I'm pretty excited, you know. I just, just hope it goes really well. Definitely. I uh, see you, you went with the uh, beige sweater. <laughs> Get him, Sid. Get him. Uh, hi. Hi, sir. I'm Michael. Hey, Michael. How are you? I'm doing well. How are you? Why are you here? Uh, I'm here to take your daughter out on a date. You are? Yes, sir. Okay, well, you uh, got a few minutes, so I need you to fill out this application. Oh, yeah, definitely. You can uh, take your time and um, leave a deposit in the kitchen. Application to date my daughter. E yeah, definitely. Oh, hey, Meg. Oh, I like your base sweater. So, where did you decide to take her on the date? Well, I thought Wendy's at first, but uh, then I finally decided to go to Burger King because you really can't go wrong with Burger King. <laughs> What's your value, man? Right, right. So, uh, the application he made you fill out, was a little unusual. Uh, what did you think of it? Well, uh, if I was a dad, I'd want to ask this stuff too. Like, one of the questions was, do you have access to a waterbed? That was like, a no-brainer. Of course I have access to a waterbed. It's up in my room right now. But... <laughs> uh, are you still happy with your uh, sweater choice? Oh, yeah. I mean, now we have something in, in common. It's great. I'm in beige, she's in beige, we look great together, definitely. Yeah, I'm ecstatic. So you think the date's going well then? Um, I think she's getting the vibe that I'm the strong and silent type, but through my silence, I think we're really connecting. I mean, it's deep, it's great. So Meg, how did you feel about him sitting next to you in the car? Um, yeah, I don't really know him, so it was a little awkward, I felt kind of uncomfortable honest here. Pretty uncomfortable. So, yeah. did you not like it when he sat next to you in the restaurant? Um, normally the, the way the tables were arranged was supposed to be, you know, face to face. But, I'm gonna let him lead on this stage, so. So, are you still happy with your sweater choice then? Um, you know, it is a little, it's a little weird. I think he's a little more into it than I am. But, what can you do, right? So, how do you think the date's going? Um, I'm not going to say I doubt picking contestant number two. Not that I wish I had contestant number one or three, but uh, we'll see. It's not over yet. So, we're some improvement.
hiding in a safer place Under cops staying dry and warm You give me feelings that I Do you like it? Well, my name on your mom's card? Yeah. Do you like it? Yeah. No, it's a, I like it. C says M and M forever. think we really connected it was it was great we definitely had something there what can we expect on your Facebook status tonight hmm um, went to BK with Meg Kane no regrets do you think she's actually gonna call you oh yeah definitely of course who wouldn't no I'm not gonna call 